Hey guys, what's up? This is Anneli and this is my LG G6 T Mobile LG G6 H872 running Pixel Experience ROM. And this video for those who stuck with any custom ROM and they wanted to flash uh, to the uh, stock ROM without PC. So I told uh, about uh, in my last video I told about this, but uh, many of you uh, wanted a video about it. So here we go. So now I am on the Pixel Experience uh, Experience ROM, and make sure you only uh, if you have like T-Mobile H872 version of uh, H872 version. Uh, let me focus on. That. I think I can focus with that. Yeah. Okay, so now you can see that it's at 872 and uh, running Android 10 pixel experience ROM. So it's uh, this video only for T-Mobile version. Do not flash these files in any other variant of LG G6. So first of all, you have to download two files, which is uh, uh, number one is the pixel ROM, which is in, in my SD card. Oh, sorry. Uh, number one is the this H8720 G zip file which is 2.52 gigabyte file and this is the official stock Android 820 G update ROM and the second thing you have to download is uh, Mag, Mag, Magis V20 so the both file available in the in the description there are, there is a link you can download from there and make sure you put it in your SD card not internal because uh, in this uh, particular case we have to wipe internal I'm not sure but I, I do all the time when I flash the stock ROM so now we have to go into recovery mode so for that as always we have to press the volume down and the power button continuously until we see the LG logo on the restart so right here release your now release your power button and press it again and you will see this page I hope you can see that but uh, wait a second can I turn down the ISO yes I can but still I think you know yeah now you can see so you have to press volume down on yes when uh, your yes button is black like highlighted press the power button then press volume down and press the power button on yes again and it will boot into recovery which is drop recovery okay uh, here we go here we have the top recovery and uh, let me turn on the ISO. Okay, so go to wipe again, like all the time we do. Uh, go to advanced wipe and wipe all these Delvic uh, slash art cache system data internal cache. If you have something important internal, uh, you have to back it up to your SD card or, or your PC, but I assume that you don't have a PC, that's why you're watching this video. So yeah you have to back it up somehow I don't know you have to put it in your SD card okay so now we are going to swipe it to reset it wipe all the data and now go back go back again and click on install select your SD card because the files are in the SD card so now here is the tricky part uh, make sure you follow step by step me like me so first you have to flash the H8720 G zip okay and make sure you wait till the end don't skip it because it don't have progress bar as I swipe it and it will show right here that there is no progress indicator so be patient so there is no pro progress indicator in this but it is flashing so it will take two, three, maybe five minutes maximum. But you don't have to panic and just wait 
wait it to be finished okay uh, from last video and this video I'm making this on my DSLR camera so hope the quality is better than before because uh, before that I was making on another phone another cell phone uh, on another cell phone so it was not that good but hopefully now you can see everything clearly and it says flashing system okay so you have to turn it on again is that flashing system this will take a bit please wait so i did uh, i'm doing this on 80 percent charge or maybe no not 80 maybe 71 yeah you can see so but make sure you have 80 or like that battery because maybe a phone get uh, hotter earlier yeah it's getting hot and it drain faster So it's still, it's still doing its thing in the background, it's flashing, don't be panicked. I'm not skipping this part because some of you may concern about your phone and they want to know that does it really work or not. So I'm not skipping anything, I'm showing you everything uh, live here. Let's uh, turn on the display again. Okay, let's wait. Okay, so it's doing something and here we go. It says uh, script succeed result was um, flash complete and on this point uh, please don't uh, be hurry on this point you don't have to reboot okay. Uh, in other norm we do reboot a system but we have to press back now because we have to flash this uh, mag magis 20 v20.4 uh, why we need that uh, because uh, we want to keep our recovery system and this will also give us road in the LG uh, stock Android 8 ROM so make sure you flash that do not reboot otherwise you may lose the top recovery and then you cannot flash any custom ROM and you lose all the basically fun stuff you have to go into LG up and you need PC again to flash and root and everything. So just uh, flash the magis uh, as well. And after, okay, so it's doing its thing. So after uh, that, you just have to reboot. Some people uh, do Delvic wipe in the end of the uh, videos. Oh, I, I mean in the end of the flashing as well but I never do I do it in the wipe uh, section at one swipe so now we just have to reboot and one more thing uh, when you reboot it first time it will reboot twice like it will show the LG logo or maybe T mobile logo then it will reboot again like you're saying here but don't be panic it will work so it's sh showing the LG logo and uh, and then you see it's doing that again uh, when I first time I flashed this I think something is wrong with that it's a boot loop or something but it will work after first uh, restart it will restart and then now it will boot into the ROM with the mobile logo At least uh, last some time I flashed two or three times. Yeah, now it's doing it. Maybe it will restart again, but uh, don't be panicked. Uh, I don't think it will restart again, but okay. So it's starting uh, the ROM. Okay, so let me brighten up. Okay, so now we are going to skip everything because I don't wanna. Why there is no skip button here on the bike? Yeah, we have. I'm gonna skip. Let's 
to white. Let me turn down the ISO. Okay, we have to continue. Okay, I'm not giving any name to this device. No thanks. I just want to show you that it will work. So I'm skipping all the things. You can sign into your account and do a restore thing. It will take some time. And accept. Then we have T-Mobile. Accept, accept. Then we have um, how you want to use it, like uh, with the app drawer. I always use with app drawer like it, but you can do any any of it. It's on your choice. So here we go. That's how you can flash the stock uh, stock LG ROM. Let me turn down the ISO again. Okay, so that's how you got. Come on. Come on, don't do that, okay. So it's maybe starting, still starting up. So it's slow. Okay, so go into about, we have uh, the software version of Android 8. And as you can see, it's 20G update, H8, 70 to 20G. So now most of people concerned that everything is working or not. Yes, let me check the camera. Later, later. Okay, the camera works, and the front camera also works. Okay, you can see me. Uh, I don't want to show myself. Okay, so everything is working without PC. You don't need a PC if you're stuck with the Pixel Experience ROM. Actually, uh, what what is the uh, if you have this error, uh, you can actually get rid of that in the network, in the call, and turn off the Wi-Fi call. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so story of, uh, behind this, uh, in this lockdown, my PC is not, my PC was not working actually. So I was, I just flashed it. I wanted to test some ROMs and I flashed LG Experience ROM. Then I noticed that there is no FM radio, there is no 4K, and the battery life was, like not so good so I was stuck and I was searching for any way to flash the stock from without PC and then I find XDF forms where I find these files and that's how I flash my stock from so hopefully you like this video guys and make sure to hit the like button share with your friends who ever have LG G6 T mobile version Make sure this uh, you flash it on T-Mobile only. I'm saying it again and again because otherwise you may break your phone. Okay, so hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe uh, for more cool videos like that. And I'm still planning to upload some more for the custom ROMs. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good day. Bye-bye.